A dramatic arrest operation led by a commando unit of Venezuela's intelligence agency. Edgar Zambrano, the country's assembly vice president, was arrested in front of his Democratic Action Party's headquarters in eastern Caracas. The opposition official, the second highest opposition figure in rank after Juan Guaido, live tweeted the arrest. We were talking with our colleague Edgar Zambrano when we saw members of the special police trying to break his car window. They weren't able to break in, so they brought a tow truck and took him away, practically kidnapped him. Zambrano is the first senior opposition official taken into custody by Venezuela's government in retaliation for a failed military uprising last week. The country's Supreme Tribunal has charged Edgar Zambrano and nine other opposition officials of treason and other high crimes. The president of the Supreme Tribunal defended the legality of the arrests. The Supreme Court of Justice and its magistrates and judges reaffirm to the Venezuelan people and the whole world their strong attachment to the Constitution, the laws and the service of the proper administration of justice. Since the April 30th failed attempt to oust President Nicolas Maduro, repression against members of the opposition has intensified. The United States, who actively support Venezuela's opposition, have warned that Zambrano's arrest will have serious consequences. Peru and Argentina have also publicly condemned what they have called an arbitrary arrest.